Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. I'm Sean. If you're new here, welcome. In a few minutes, you're gonna meet my wife, Astrid. We live here in Mexico with our five cats. My wife works in fashion, I surf, and that's about all you need to know. Let's go. I don't really like know what the waves are like today. We're gonna head down to uh, we're gonna head down to Punta Mita and just see like what's going on down there. Surfers go through this like math of what board they're gonna ride, but since I don't have like a lot of boards, I basically have two modes for when I surf. Do I feel like shit or do I not feel like shit? I feel shit. I'm gonna ride like that blue thing because it's got like a lot more volume. You feel confident just paddling, you know? So I'll ride the fish beard if I feel good because I like, I feel like I've got it, you know what I mean? That's my math. I don't have anything about wind or waves or conditions or anything like that. If the waves are good and I feel good, I ride something a little more aggressive. If I feel like how I feel today, like a bit sluggish and a little heavy and a kind of like, I ride the other thing. We're gonna go stop at a place after the surf, a new place called Chamuk. It's like vegetarian, sort of like fancy, but homespun Mexican brunch. I have no idea, but it's like not even on the beaten path. It's like on the main road, which is off the beaten path. I only surfed for about 40 minutes yesterday, but what was really cool about yesterday is that I had a couple waves and like a couple of the locals who are really good surfers, the, the good locals, they, they actually like acknowledged me yesterday. And I, I think that feels good because I, I grew up being like a local at a surf spot. I know what it means for like the locals to go out of their way and like give you a whistle or a shaka. Like the one dude said hello. The other dude was on the beach giving some lessons and like I had a really good left. And when I got them the left, he was like, did like the Mexican whistle thing like the yeah, it was just like, it was nice to be the old guy in the water yesterday, just trying to get out there, get wet, get my feet, and like, have the, have the like, the young buck be like, you know, like that's a, that's a good feeling. Waiting for Astrid to go hit the bathroom. One of the good things about coming to Veneros is that it's kind of civilized, like there's a bathroom and a shower, there's like a little restaurant situation over here. All right, not seeing a ton of waves here, but this isn't the break. Look, it could be dead flat, like nothing, but even with these like tiny little knee-high things, I'll still go out there and surf. This is the first time I'm on the beach since Germany, and I missed it so much. What did you just say, by the way? Sean is here now, so they're gonna be waves. Uh, it's looking pretty small. <laughs> I do have that yep, yep. that conjuring of the surf. It's a connection that, to the ocean you have to have. And if there's a wave, you'll find it. If there's a wave, I'm gonna dig it out, but more than that, it's gonna come to me. And that's, what, I mean, it's small. It's very small. Look at that, that's a wave. I can do that. there is when I just cut my hand on the reef.
This was my first time using a compost toilet, and I have to say, kind of impressed, like not messy. Me quieres, no me quieres. Te aclaro que me dejes. Todo estaba tan bonito. Hasta que empezó a fallar. What are you thinking about getting? I want chilaquiles. I like the idea of fozole. Mm -hmm. It's like pho, but pozole. This is the chicharron de yaca. Chicharron is like a, it's usually like fried pork skin. Yeah. Right? Because this is vegetarian, it's fried yaca. Yaca, which is like a local jackfruit. fruit. Jackfruit. So it's fried jackfruit. These are the fried jackfruit pieces, which are so good. Dr. Joe. Call him back. Sorry, Dr. Joe. Try a little of the hot. This is like an aguacate sauce. We can't recommend this place enough. The food was amazing. The vibe was on point. It's vegetarian, no alcohol. Like it was just a clean place. It was just so good. Can't wait to go back. I'm on it 24 7, 25 8. I just pick up the pace and I violate. I eat it all up like a dinner plate. I've been on the move like I'm running late. Left, right, left, let's go. I'm unstoppable like I'm money flowing in. In case you didn't know that you. So if you're new here, please uh, hit that like button and also subscribe. If you're not new here, you probably recognize that these are my aeration shoes. Astrid made them for me and they're, they're pretty friggin' gnarly. I also got some seeds, some grass seeds. We've got an area here that just, just like isn't performing, so I'm gonna open it up with the aeration. I'm gonna put some seeds in there and kind of let it do its thing. Hey, so that's the video for today. Thank you so much again for stopping by. I love you guys. I love you so much. I don't even know how to tell you, but uh, yeah, we're gonna do it again next week. Gonna be more surfing, more food, and more whatever. They doubt me, now I got them like, wow, making boss moves, I've been on a roll. Bomb blowing up, gotta put them on hold. I am the bag, that's what I've been told. I keep my cool under pressure like a boss. I'm all in, it don't matter what it costs. All I do is win and a good from the top. Let's go.